I do. When you throw this frog, try to throw it in the clear water first and then sneak it up there. Sometimes you land in it and then all the green stuff gets in the hooks. Man, these fish ain't active at all today. Suck that one. He sucked it down. That's a giant fish. And all I did is lift up the reels, guys. Little froggy bass. Ain't bad. You snuck up right on it. All right, on these frog fishing guys, all I did is lift up the rod tip. That's all you do and reel. No snatching, just lift up the rod tip. Little small frog. I love the small frog. This is a bayou frog, booyah frog. And this is my favorite color. And it's the best frog ever used. It's sharp. Been using this one for a while, and it's still sharp. See? Small frog, guys. But it don't matter. The big frogs, lift up your rod tip and reel. As soon as he goes down, let him turn down there. Lift it up. Lift the rod tip up and reel, and you will hook every fish. You will... You, because what happens, he opens his mouth and he hits it. Look where the hooks are. When you set the hook, it's gonna, it's always gonna be, be in the throat or in the top lips. Most of the time it's gonna be in his throat. So make sure all you do is lift up the rod and reel, especially if you got braid. You got braid, there's no stretch. And the little frog's going to just smash down and you're going to hook him every time. But if you do a snatch...